In today's video, I'm going to show the most important virus tips and tricks that every beginner should know. For virus Q, you don't need to fully charge it to deal maximum damage. Try to hit Q directly on the enemy champion, because if it hits multiple targets, damage is reduced. You can use his Q through walls to deal damage to your opponents. While charging Q, you can use Flash to close the distance. One trick you can use to hit Q more easily is to use Q when your opponent is near a wall because you have less space to move. Or you can use it from a place where enemies can't see you. Also, his Q can be used to check the bushes for enemies. If you hit a hidden enemy there, you will hear a specific sound. When you activate W, you will deal more damage with Q. Also, when you auto attack a target, you apply double stacks on it. Depending on how many stacks the target has, after using Cure E, the cooldown of the abilities will be reduced. Virus E hitbox is more than a spell indicator. When you want to combine E with Flash, use Flash first and then E. When playing with Virus, you don't need to buy anti heal items because his E applies grievous wounds to the target. Once you reach level 3, the basic trading combo is E, W, 3 auto attacks, Q. Virus R hitbox is bigger than the spell indicator. Use his ultimate through walls to deal damage and surprise your opponents. The closer you are to the target, the faster his ultimate will land. That's why you can use R first and then flash to stun your opponent faster. His ultimate can stun and damage multiple opponents. There is an indicator that shows the stun range. But the indicator is not correct, because the last target is not stunned instantly. Also, his ultimate applies 3W stacks on the target. Once you reach level 6, the win combo is R, W, Q, Auto Attack, E, Auto Attack, Q. When attacking the enemy towers, last hit the minions as well, because this way you will increase your attack speed. You can combine Q with Gale Force to burst a nearby opponent. Also, you can combine R with Gale Force to hide the R animation. When you use Zonas, you can only activate W. In team fights, stay in the back lane of your team and try to deal as much damage as possible to the closest enemies. Also, try to stun as many enemies as possible with your ultimate. If this video was useful to you, don't forget to like it. 